The other day, I was talking to brother, uh, not brother, uh, uh, little DeAndre. DeAndre is seven years old. Seven years old. And we're out there pruning. And, he's, and he was my, he was my uh, catcher. You know, he's catching uh, the, right. the, the branches for me and moving it for me and everything like that. And so I was talking to Brother Tyler. And Brother Tyler, if he's on there, he, he can attest to this. So I said, let me show you something. I was showing Tyler. So I said, let me show you something. I said, DeAndre, come here. I said, DeAndre, stand on one leg. Guess what he did? What do you think he did? He stood on one leg. I said, DeAndre, get in the push-up position. He got in a push-up position. I said, DeAndre, if I told you to eat bake, if I told you to eat uh, swine, would you? He says, he, he gave me this look. Huh? He was like scratching his head. I can't do that. <laughs> he says, I'm not. I said, why wouldn't you not do that? He says, because that goes against the most high yah. I said, well, I'm going to give you a spanking. Now what? Are you going to do it now? Do you want to get a spanking? He says, I'm still not going to eat. I'm just going to have to get a spanking. I said, that's my boy right there. <laughs> Look at that. I mean, this is a set. The kingdom of heaven are like one of these. Like one of these. He got it. Even just little things I was teaching him and Ayana. Um, you know, because, you know, hey, being the father to the fathers, isn't that amazing, right? Isn't that amazing? And so I teach little DeAndre how to run a community. I kind of tell him a little different. I say, I'm going to teach you how to be a man, okay? And you show different aspects and stuff like that. So the other day, uh, his mother came. And his mother said, um, uh, mother, uh, Sister Kairisha was saying that uh, I told uh, 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 Ayana to help uh, DeAndre. And so she came in and helped him. You know, doing some Lego. And then all of a sudden, DeAndre took the toy and snatched it from her. You know, and, and she said, I'm trying to help. You know, and so, you know, you would think when you first hear it that DeAndre needs to get in trouble. Why are you snatching the toy? All right? And this is how we infeminate our boys and, and turn them into little girls. And say, so, well, don't do that. You know what's supposed to do that. So the first thing I'm wondering, why would DeAndre snatch the toy from his sister? Why would he have to do that? He said, I said, DeAndre, why did you snatch a toy out of your sister? He said, well, because she was, I was working on the, uh, the big Legos, and, and, and I said, what, what, what did you want to do? I wanted her to tear apart the, the little Legos. I said, okay, that's fair. I mean, you did, she, your, her mother did say, come and help you. You know, if that wasn't helping, I could see why you'd be frustrated, right? So I said, okay, next time when, when your sister come, you, tell, you need to give her directions. Commander, say, this is how you can help me. And so then I brought Ayana in. See, guys, I'm teaching you a little bit about parenting, just a little, like, real-life experience. So I said, I, I said, Ayana, I said, now, what happened? She said, and then she's, you know, thinking she's going to get in trouble. And I said, Ayana, I said, well, 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 I was trying to help him and everything. I said, you were trying to help him. How, did he tell you what to do? No, but I just, my, my mom told me to come and help him, and I was just helping. I said, okay, Ayana, you are, you are a girl, and one day you're going to be a bride, okay? You're going to be somebody's husband, okay? And wow. somebody's uh, a bride, Ishaya. A wife, but I said Ishai, a woman. And so you need to learn how to be a good helpmeet. So I'm going to teach you how to be a good helpmeet. How can I feel confident that I can teach a girl how to be a helpmeet? Because I'm a helpmeet. So I said, next time, when mommy tells you to go and help your brother, this is what I want you to do. You go to your brother and ask him, how may I help you? Isn't that bad right there? And don't just go in there and start doing stuff and say, well, I'm going to come and help him. How many of you sister go out there trying to help your man and say, well, let me, let me bring books to him to read and, and videos to watch it, watches and watches, instead of you saying, how may I help you? How about that? How may I help you? If I'm here to be your help me, I'm not here to tell you what to do. I'm not here to usurp your authority. I'm here to help you. How may I help you? How about that for a second? Mm -hmm. Just ask it. And so... So Ayana, so I taught her, this is what I do, I do role play with them. So I said, okay, so now, so I they had some magazines. I had some magazines on, the, on, the, um, on my table, and I threw it on the floor. I kind of spread it all over the place, right? And then I said, um, DeAndre, pick this thing up. So now I'm the bride, I'm, I'm the bridegroom. So I tell my, my, my bride, pick it up. So he's picking it up, and Ayana's next to me. I said, okay, Ayana, now you go help your brother. And I wanted to see what she was going to do. So she went to, DeAndre, how may I help you? And DeAndre says, go pick those things up over there, right? So she, she went to do what DeAndre told her. So she did. What, and then there was more on another spot. I said, DeAndre, is that everything? And he says, I think that's everything. And I can tell. And, and Deandre is trying to point like, there's more here. And I said, DeAndre, how about this over here? Ayana didn't even go pick it up because she, now she's just a little girl, okay, at the age of directive. But she said, hey, he just told me to pick this. I'm not going outside of what he told me to pick. <coughs> so DeAndre went to go. He decided, I'm going to go pick it up. He, I, I'll go pick this up. And he picked it up. 
See, look how you can teach the next generation on how to be in their role. And so they will grow up thinking like, I was trying to help. How many of this where sisters will try to be trying to teach their husband what to do and how to be a man? You can't. A woman can't teach a man. It's out of order. Because once you start doing that, that man will never try to lead. He'll just try to stay away from you. He'll go look on the rooftop somewhere because he's dealing with a contentious woman. You go from trying to be a help me to now being a contentious woman, a hinder me. Do you guys understand what I'm saying? Is this making sense to you guys? Is this making sense? To, okay. So this is how. And so guess what? And then, so then went from that. And then I went to Sister Kyrisha. I said, so Sister Kyrisha, now I'm teaching her. This is what I want you to do from now on. So now I'm trying to get her in line with what I'm trying to do with the, the little ones here. Saying this is how. So the next time you tell your daughter to go help uh, her, her brother, you make sure she you remind her, go ask him how she can help her brother. So she can now stay in her role. And it's so simple. Now DeAndre feels better. He's not like frustrated. Like, what do I do? I mean, she's trying to help me, but I don't feel like she's helping me. But now he knows this is how you can help me. And I'm teaching him. You give her command. You don't say please. Well, please, can you do this? No, no, no. You a man. You command. You command. Does Yah say please? Could you do this? Please, could you keep my command? Can you please do this? Can you please do the Shabbat? No. Does he do that? No. Does he tell us please? Thank you? No. He command. We shouldn't be, when my coach used to tell me, get your ass out there. I just, we just got there. Well, you didn't say it nicely. No. They'll say, what the hell is going on? What? Are you a football player? No. They'll just give you command and you do it. Period. 